Yo, what up, guys? Make sure you guys like, subscribe, get us to 5,000. These chicks, man, like, the shit they make me do, bro, it's fucked. So let's get it done. Like, like, let's say someone's trying to renovate the upstairs of their their house. They're trying to like put hardwood in. Yeah. How much for the junk removal you think for that? On it. I mean, it's but it's it's hard to say. It depends on how much. I I, I go by the trailer because I got a bunch of trailers at my yard. So like, if I do like uh, the two trailers, if, if I fill up two 16 foot trailers of, of junk and then and I have to drive to dump it, yeah, you're looking at like fifteen hundred bucks easily. Easy. They would charge the guys would charge for oh, bucks. Absolutely, bro. Yeah. For two sixty foot trailers, bro. You you get charged three fifty for the tiny little guys. Like there's little cube vans, bro. You know the little god the god junk um the junk yeah. removal people. Like, yeah, just that, bro. Like I bro, it's just it's just so much money because I've had to use them in the past. And, and then you go to the junkyard and you throw it out for free. And right? then you go throw it out. So you just pay them, they come, you load you up, and they're out. So it's uh, you know, it's it's easy money, it's good money, it's really good it's money. It's hard labor though, eh? I don't know you hand it, you just hire some Mexicans. So. Uh, <laughs> well, you gotta do it yourself in the, in the start to start off. Yeah, right? yeah, in the start off, yeah. But it's but good I, money if you start off yourself, like fifteen hundred bucks. Yeah, bro, it's but good I, money, bro. But you're not gonna get make, make fifteen hundred bucks like every time. It's gonna be like more like three hundred bucks a load, two hundred bucks a load. No, it depends on the load, bro. A sixteen foot trailer is massive, bro. 16 like foot a trailer. sixteen foot trailer is huge, bro. It's like it's damn near like. So think about this table. Yeah. This table is about sixteen feet, and the height of the ceiling. And the floor, like from the floor to this. But you're not going to get a 16 foot thing every single time, though. No, no, you're not going to get that. But I'm saying, like, you're not going to take jobs. Like, I'm not going to take, bro, I don't get out of my house for less than, you know, grand. So you're not going to take the little jobs. But don't right? you have to go into the bin, take, take it out, load it up to your truck, so on and so forth? Into what bin? Go so, to the. So, go, so, you, you, so you, have the, you have the big bin, right? The yeah. 16 foot bin, right? Don't you have to go into the bin? Grab the stuff and then load it to your truck. Is that how it is? Yeah, yeah. You just do like, if, so you for gotta, example, like, manually get in there. Yeah, yeah. Pull well, up the stuff. Well, it's an enclosed. It's not a bin. It's a trailer. Like you, there's two. There's the bins that you just toss things like yeah. into the big open bins, or there's a trailer. Right. The trailer actually gets you get to house more because now with the open bin, like you you get pulled over if you can't you can't fill it past the you know what I mean like you'll get pulled over by the cops you get tickets right. Yeah. But with a trailer. Bucks for for sixteen foot trailer. Yeah, so it's and that's and that's that's a deal. Like, like just to do somebody a standard house is two Gs, twenty five hundred bucks to do a standard house power washing. Is there like uh, mm -hmm. a lot of demand for that? You think? Yeah, there's a lot of demand for power washing. I no, actually, I mean, I mean, uh, no, not power washing. Oh, I mean, for jungle, oh yeah, junk removal, bro. There'll never be less of a demand. Like, like I said, nobody wants to do it. That's what. Nobody wants to do it, and it's just you can't avoid it. You can't start yeah, you can't. a job. You can't do anything without creating garbage, right? Why didn't? But you own a construction company. Why don't you just do it yourself? Do what myself? Junk removal yourself. Like, why don't you put it in your cots to, to remove the junk? Oh, I do. I do sometimes. Like, but like before I had the company, like, you know, I did real estate. I had a lot of properties. And every time I sold a property or I was renting it, I, like, I kick people out of my house and then they have all this junk. Like, what am I going to do, right? You know what I mean? This is back in the day. So that's why I know about the junk removal. And then my buddy started a junk removal company. So when I naturally, when I started my construction company, I always, I, like, we do everything. We do junk removal. We'll do, like, you know, power washing, stone, hardscapes. Like, I, bro, during COVID, you know how many, like, garages they turn into gyms? Yeah, that's true. But we, we, that was the biggest thing because nobody could go to the gym. Everybody's staying home. I, I must have done, like, 20 at-home, two-car garage conversions, bro. And I got my HVAC guys. I got, I get, like, it's all, it's a, it's a big company it's like we do everything right yeah. so but you know it's it the guys just focus exactly on the junk removal like they'll but just if, focus if, on that if they do junk removal can't they also do moving too sorry so if they do junk removal can't they also add like movers as well well see they can't if they have the bin if they have the open bin they can't that's what i'm saying that's why i bought the trailers bro the trailers are so utilitarian the trailers the ones that like you have like a like a normal trailer like you, 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 you attach yeah, to your I car hook up my truck yeah and it's like a big white trailer and clothes i can do moving i can do junk removal you yeah, can do you anything like, i even deliver plants like big like two thousand yeah, five thousand yeah, yeah. dollar plants and, and, and the trailers you can, you can buy for more yeah, if you're just starting out, you, yeah, yeah, for sure. You get something small, get your, get your feet wet, and then you go from there, right? But how, wait, how, you, you drive a 16 foot trailer, the one like you. you attach well, to it your attaches car. to my truck. I, I dock, <laughs> like yeah. So we, we like we have a job. We have something we need. Like uh, we'll pick up the trailer, drop it on site, and then go home. And then the guys. Sixteen feet's not that. Bad. It's not that bad. It's like not I that said, big. Sixteen feet is about it's this it's long. It's not. It's not that. But bad. I've seen sixteen foot trailers that go for on Facebook Marketplace for this much, man. 